up everyone, Rebecca Hollis here and I'm with Matt Rose. Hey, so I was just walking along randomly and he saw the uh, Aranui uh, tag and he actually uh, grew up in Aranui, is that right? Yes. <laughs> and so what are you doing here? Uh, so you're obviously not living in New Zealand now, where are you living, what are you doing? I live in Toronto, Canada and I'm here uh, looking at new stuff. Now, this is the first time I've been here and it's pretty apeshit and crazy and what's the kind of the, the biggest things that you're sort of looking for at the moment or the, the cool stuff that you're seeing coming out that you think is going to be changing the world in the next 12 months? Uh, we're looking at different uh, evolving type technology, so uh, a robot, uh, we're looking at connected home products, wearables that are different and cool, um, looking at different sensory points on the body, um, things like that. Anything that's a step ahead of what's happening in the industry right now. The first thing I've noticed just walking around is literally there's a hundred thousand copy paste wearably shit, right? Like uh, track your heart, see how tell you how fat you are. Yeah. like. Is that that's already was there a couple of years ago? Like the next phase, is, is it still going to go down there more, or are there other? What's the next sort of cycle of that? Or you, st you think we're just getting started on it? Uh, where the wearables are going right now is actually lifting different types of uh, information from the body. So, for example, heart rate was something that was introduced to the market last year. So now you're looking at oxygen levels, things like that. So traditionally, that kind of stuff was coming from the wrists. Now there's products that you can put in your ear where there's actually a lot more uh, information available from the ear as opposed to being from the wrist. So you're seeing kind of integration of more movement and more different types of uh, information coming from the body based on different sensors and, and whatnot in the devices. It's kind of cool. Uh, fast food's got the, the deal in the 90s and 2000s and now we're finally getting around to some healthy stuff with tech which is kind of cool. Another thing you're saying, uh, home automation. Uh, tell me a little bit about what you're seeing there that's pretty rad that you're stoked on. Uh, one is a company called Smanos, which is a DIY home security system. So instead of paying big money to have your home monitored by a third-party company, you just buy the gear, put it in at a one-time cost. Um, you've got all your door sensors. Uh, you've got cameras that you can connect through via your phone and see what's happening in your home with two-way audio communication. And is it uh, like subscription as a service to be able to do that? No, it's a one-time fee. You buy the gear. It all comes through the app, and you just run it off your Wi-Fi system at home. And is there a cloud backup for any of that stuff as well? Is yep. it? Absolutely. So they, but they don't charge for backup. So a lot of the companies out there have a piecemeal. They'll charge you for uh, cloud backup. They don't charge anything. It's, it's all free. So wearables, home automation, anything else that you think is going to be the next big shit popping? Uh, it's hard to say. I think um, AI, like so some robot yeah. stuff we're looking at, um, that's very early days, very expensive. Drones, um, drones are about to explode they are kind of they're very big on the uh and getting regulated yes yeah. um but there's a you know there's a lot of use cases for it and you'll see a lot of drones coming into the market to do different things for different in industries so think construction i gotta pay a guy to go walk up 20 flights of stairs to look at something yeah. i just send my drone up i just save myself an hour's worth of wage things like that there's a there's a real roi uh, connected to a lot of that stuff um, but it's early days on some stuff. Uh, quality is an issue. Um, warranty is an issue. People crashing drones. Shitty batteries are an issue. Shitty batteries. <laughs> Shitty pilots. <Yeah. laughs> That's good. Hey man, awesome. Good to see another Arunui kid doing well. Good shit. Hey man.